and what's um, 2nd of January 2019 and I'm just heading towards Chinaman's Creek believe it or not I didn't realize that was actually the name of this particular creek but uh, in the Cairns Post they said that uh, they found a dead body uh, somewhere in it don't know if it's this part but there it is the majestic uh, Chinaman's Creek <laughs> or not so majestic people have been quite friendly today the, the bus driver was really good so I'll probably get a grumpy one on the return trip uh, he was nice and I think he actually said happy new year so that was nice of him and uh, Dan Murphy girl was, was very pleasant probably relieved because I imagine the place would have been absolute chockers before um, the new years would have been a shocking time Look at this, just walk straight across the road, it's fantastic, it's quiet at the moment uh, but the bus turned up on, well it turned up really early still had to wait at the bloody shopping centre the, 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 the shopping centre diversion which is a pain because it probably adds uh, several minutes to the trip not just a long trip but yeah I just always need to cop the bloody bus that uh, diverts to the shopping centre uh, but at least this time there's a lot of people got off at that stop so that was something there's a few people waiting at the bus stop now over there so hopefully it means another bus might be coming soon so uh, yeah my last trip was a lot more eventful than this so I, I thought I sat behind uh, or in front of uh, a couple I thought it'd be a good place to uh, to sit they're not going to cause any trouble uh, boy was I wrong there they uh, the girls started to punch into the guy and uh, but it didn't last long and she uh, ended up apologizing to everybody including the driver uh, but uh, something to do with Christmas something to do with Christmas dinner or something some dispute regarding that always a great time to pe bring people together and fight you know, the, the uh, festive, festive season a lot of wind here so I'm sorry about the audio but uh, I'm going to do a 2019 uh, uh, video because it's been well the new year is it's going to be interesting because there's a hell of a lot happened in 2018 it was extremely eventful on a personal and global basis so uh, a lot to to be said there's the weather's still quite pleasant and we've had two days without a lot of rain so that's good so um because we've had you know weeks of rain so this is actually a nice break although there is another um uh, cyclone up north around Weeper with a, a mini mine that takes place uh, it's just a mining town basically but uh, they copped a bit of wind apparently uh, 100 kilometer winds I think it was and uh, so not didn't look like that much damage that they had on the photos of but still uh, not pleasant it's it's been windy here look it's like a constant subtly which can be good or bad depending but I'd, I'd rather rather have this weather any day it's just been so much more pleasant I can cop a bit of wind if, if it's cool weather which it is it's quite quite uh, quite manageable haven't had the aircon on for weeks I've only only used it about three nights as it turned out um, so I'm not going to cop a huge electricity bill hopefully if I do I'll be screaming because I haven't actually changed my consumption much using fans obviously more but that's not going to take, cost too much dough I don't think ceiling fans and other fans in the house but um, I find that they're generally adequate to keep things under control and yeah, that wind's certainly gusting up but um, yeah so far it's been a good day today fingers crossed it continues on and uh, now I've got myself, I've got myself some Hoe Garden beer, which I, I actually tried at the, um, in the, um, when I was in Tiamat Island and Juara Beach, because it's duty free there, so it wasn't too expensive. Actually, it was on special for 16 for a, six, for a four pack. So it's not a cheap beer, but um, it's about double what I'd normally want to pay on special, which is about two bucks a bottle. So I just wanted to sample it, see if I still like it, because I've only ever had it on the island several times, and. Uh, a lot of the times they ran out of supplies, but uh, yeah, it was a really nice drop. So, um, it's the first time I've seen it on the shelves, but uh, then again, it doesn't mean it hasn't been there. It's just I'm, I'm hopeless at uh, you know, with attention to detail. That's not one of my fortes. 
I don't know how many four days I've got actually, to be quite free. But uh, yeah, a few clouds here, but uh, not, not a bad day, pretty pleasant. And uh, unfortunately my electric scooter still in the sh is, is out of commission and I, I thought it was a simple puncture, but I think it's more than that. I took, bought some pliers so I could ex extract the metal coming out of the, the, uh, the front tyre, but it didn't work. So I don't know what I'm going to do, maybe just cut, cut it off and hopefully... I'm going to hit, probably have to take it somewhere to get a look at it, because I think it's deflated now, which is real pain. So, um, out of commission with the electric scooter, unfortunately. Yeah, it's taken a while for the bus to show, but it uh, shouldn't be too much longer, hopefully. Uh, yeah, fingers crossed. And hopefully I won't have to do the, um, the shopping centre diversion a few blocks before I get off. It's a bit of a pain. I mean, if I had extra, if I could take more, more uh, supplies, I'd actually do my supermarket shopping there. But unfortunately, um, I just don't, you know, walking, I just don't have the capacity. I don't think it's one of those shopping trolley things. Uh, which are quite practical, but... Uh, Probably look a bit daggy, and I mean it's pathetic that I, I admit this, but I do worry about the way it looks, and it's not. Yeah, there's, oh, there's a guy on a bloody mobility uh, scooter on the uh, service road. Maybe he's trying to make money as a taxi, as a uh, bus driver or something. So a, a uh, like an Uber version of buses, picking up a passenger. You don't need to take one if, if that. Yeah, it's amazing where those guys go. Please uh, consider subscribing to my channel if they think there's anything there of, uh, of use to you or entertainment or whatever. And uh, either give do that or give me a thumbs up or, or if you're feeling really energetic, do both. That'd be great. Uh, but uh, please don't ignore me. That's the worst thing you can do on YouTube is be ignored.